Good morning, everyone. Fantastic and lovely to see year four, five and six in the hall. Uh, other classes in your classrooms looking very smart as usual. Um, visitors, um, safely distanced in school, welcome. Lovely to see you this morning. And lots of people at home as well. Thank you so much for joining us for our celebration assembly this morning. Uh, I'm just keeping an eye on the waiting room to let a few people in. Right, but uh, warm welcome. We're going to get cracking with our special celebration book, which has got uh, some people's names in who've got well-deserved certificates. I've got them all in the hall this morning. So when we come to individual classes, I will go to individual classes um, and then I'll bring the certificates to you uh, as soon as assembly's finished, okay? So we'll start with reception. I have a picture up there. We're looking at all the names, lots of names for July 2021. And we're starting with a young man in reception. He was made super progress and effort with his reading. He's worked really hard in guided reading sessions. Well done, Lewis Duffin. Just gonna find reception. There we are. There's Lewis. Hi, Lewis. Well done. And Sorry, I'll just. Okay. Um, and another person who is doing really well with their reading, for careful sounding out uh, when reading and writing using your keywords and trying your best. Fantastic, Imogen Jones. Well done, Imogen. And we've got somebody else uh, from reception as well. Delighted to give this certificate out this morning. Always joining in PE with enthusiasm. You have shown super skills in tennis. Obviously the next, um, well, if I said the next Virginia way, nobody would know what I was talking about. So I won't say that right. Well done, Kaylee Ellis. Okay, so let's just see, we've got Kaylee, Lewis and Imogen there in reception. Well done, you three. Brilliant, well done. Right, we'll move on to year one. And if I can just find them first, we'll put year one up first. Let me find them. There we go. And another couple of people waiting, so we'll let them in as well. What year is he? Um... Okay, year one looking very smart. Well done. Okay, the first person in year one getting a certificate is a young boy who's got a super attitude towards learning. You've made great progress this year with your reading and writing. Well done, James McLean. Well done, James. Stay there so we can see you. Um, another young man who I know to be an amazing mathematician. Um, so for being an amazing mathematician, we love your super speedy mental math strategies. Well done, Toby Percival.
Well done, Toby. Fantastic. And I think everybody in year one will know who this is when I start reading out what the certificate's for, but uh, for a great start to Hillside, we're going to love having you in our class. Really super start to Hillside life for Kader Watt. Well done, Kader. <laughs> Well done to our three year one certificate winners. Brilliant. Thank you. Okay, we'll now move on to year two. We'll just find them. Um, I think that's year two. Well, year two classroom. There we go. Can just about there we go. Morning, year two. Well done. That's better. Right. Uh, for a super attitude to learning, always persevering, even when you find it tricky. Well done, Kayla Kerwin. Well done, Kayla. <laughs> fantastic. And somebody else who's got a fantastic attitude to learning, a super year in year two, always enthusiastic, Always willing to have a go at everything that is asked of him. Well done, Sam Ianson. <laughs> well done, Sam. Can't see you. Where's he gone? <laughs> there we are. Well done, Sam. Fantastic. Um, I'll tell you what I noticed then in year two, and I noticed every time I present a certificate, and I've presented obviously a lot of them now over the years, the joy on classmates' faces is always absolutely brilliant, and that everybody else in the class was obviously really pleased there when I read Kayla's name out, when I read uh, Sam's name out. So uh, really nice that everybody else was pleased for you. And for always coming into school, into class with a smile on your face and being such a kind and caring human being, wonderful Idris Mills. Well done, Idris. Well done, Idris. Fantastic. And there's our three year two certificate winners looking very smart there and lead learner badge attached as well as that Idris as well yeah fantastic well done right we shall move on to year three there we can see year three looking very smart okay the first person in year three to get a certificate thanks for the waves at the back girls um for being a wonderful author a wonderful artist and for being determined to swim the whole length of the pool. Amazing. So we've got somebody who's brilliant at English, tries really hard in everything. Uh, and I would agree. Amazing. Bella Valentina Ferraro. Well done, Bella. Well done, Bella, and well deserved. Okay, um, somebody else, we had a marvellous mathematician in year one, we've got another one in year three, I know, for being a magnificent mathematician, fabulous Henry Fleming. Well done, Henry. And another magnificent mathematician as well, um, so this certificate goes to a young man for being a magnificent mathematician and a superb pyramid builder. Well done, William Fulton. Late. Right, okay, welcome to those people just joining us. Just let me 
get rid of that. There we go. We're still on year three. There's lots of people in year three getting certificates today. So that's good. Uh, I've got another marvellous mathematician. How many mathematicians have you got in that class, Mrs. Edwards? For being a wonderful mathematician and for developing super listening skills, well done, Sam Worley. Well done, Sam. And uh, somebody else, there's another, there's a maths link in year three. This is for being the multiplication king of year three. So I'm sure all of year three know who I'm talking about. For being the multiplication king of year three, super slick and quick, Max Percival. Well done, Max. Okay, we're going to move on to year four, who are with me in the hall. Thanks, year three. Well done. So we'll go back to that. Okay. Let me see. Okay, so we're on the hall. Hopefully everybody can see that. Um, first person in year four. For being a kind and thoughtful friend throughout the year, Harry will always try to help if ever there is a problem. Well done, Harry Lorimer. For always being enthusiastic and willing to have a go at everything, Alex can always be relied on to have a smile. Alex McGoldrick, well done. Alex. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, two of us coming in. Oh, my stop it. <laughs> there you go. Uh, for fantastic effort in reading. This person has tried really hard this year, both with her reading and with her reading comments. Well done, Ellie Williams. <laughs> Lots of people trying hard in year five, I don't know if you know that. Um, for a fantastic year five, making super progress and being a mature learner, certainly somebody who's ready for year six. Fantastic, Anthony Davidson. Well done. <laughs> For working hard throughout year five, being determined to do well, and for excellent end of year achievements. Fantastic, Jack Ballow. <laughs> Trying his best in all subjects for mature learning behavior that shows he is ready for year six, Mathieu Fell. Good <laughs> ladies, we've got a few more year five. Year five. I said there's a lot of people trying hard in year five. This person has tried his very best in all subjects this year. He's also a kind, and helpful member of the year five class. Well done, Bradley Grinley. Well done, Bradley. <laughs> For ex 
excellent learning behavior. I'm showing that she's now ready for year six. Heidi Fleming. And still we carry on. We have five. <laughs> Three, listen to these words. A delightful, mature member of the class who has worked hard and shown that she is ready for year six. Ava Williams. So, so our year five certificate winners, give them one last clap, please. Okay, so we move on to year six. For improving his learning attitude this year, showing maturity and resilience in what has been a personally difficult year. Well done, Tyler Grundy. For consistently setting herself the highest standards and putting in the hard work and determination to achieve them, Molly McLean. Developing this year as a capable mathematician and writer, well done and keep up the hard work, Evangeline Godwin. And for always keeping Mrs. Goff busy and having the strength of character to be the only year six child going to a different school. Oh. Well done, Puma Gavin. <laughs> so to our four, sorry Tyler, I'm not you out. So to our four year sixes, and you come in the back here. Yeah. Let's give them a clap. <laughs> And while we're on year six, just to say, fantastic, well done, brilliant year in year six this year. Um, despite all the difficulties you've got on with your learning and trying really hard, you've made fantastic progress. We know because of how well you've, you've shown us the kind you've achieved with your writing, with your maths, with your reading, that you're in a fantastic place to start high school. So on behalf of everybody in school, we'd like to wish you all the very best at high school. Good luck for the future. And thank you for being such a fantastic year six. Can we give year six a big clap? Everybody? Lovely. So the Tom Green Sexual Rights Year is for our time and contribution to our school. Thanks for giving us the best start to our hillside journey. I mean, all sign up on the I shall, I shall put that up on the display at home. Definitely. Thank you. Thanks, Holly. Thanks, Joshy. Just got a couple of special awards to give out um, for, for PE and for sport because even in this um, difficult last year, we've entered some competitions virtually. We've had intra school competitions virtually. Um, and one of the competitions we managed to enter virtually was the gymnastics competition. Um, and yes, year three four and year five six did really really well um and we're going to start with year four because i'm really pleased to announce that year four helsby hillside team 
are the county winners for gymnastics. How about that? That, that is an amazing achievement. That's not just Ellesmere and Prodigy and Prodigy and Villages partnership or the Ellesmere Port partnership are part of. That's Cheshire County Gymnastics Champions, which is amazing. So I've got gold medals and certificates. So if these people could come out and get a certificate uh, and medal. Um, Thomas Tyler Lee. Frank O'Neill. Amy Jackson. Alex McGoldrick. Ella McGregor Prenderville. <laughs> Amelia Phillips. <laughs> Sophie Smith. Lily Monroe. <laughs> Megan Monroe. <laughs> and Ellie Williams. If I can give the trophy to Thomas on behalf of everybody, well done to Thomas. Hold it up, let's give them a massive clap. Everybody. Thank you, Thomas. Okay, well done, Six Saldania for gymnastic team. And the year five, six team who entered the competition, I think Mrs. Moore came fourth. So in the county gymnastics came fourth. I'm just gonna read these names out. Well done to these children in year six. Daisy, Jake, Lizzie, Ava, Evie, Molly, Max, Connor, Lucas, Emily. And in year five, Ava, Lois, Noah, Emily, Bella, Lucy, Eva, Neve, Olivia, and Jack, well done to you for coming fourth in the county competition. And you also won what is a really difficult thing to win. There's a special award given to the team that shows the best spirit of the games. So that's taking part, respecting others, upholding all the values of the sports partnership. So can I ask you six, can I ask Connor, can you come forward and accept that? And uh, give him a clap. Well done. Well done and just to say as well, a big thank you to Mrs. Moore for all the work she did to help with the teams in gymnastics and with all the other sport and PE in school as well. Thanks, Mrs. Moore. Well done. Okay, well, on the theme of sport, we're a very sporty school. Um, I'd like to invite two of our governors to just come to the front because we've got a small presentation uh, to, to uh, hand out to someone else who's leaving um, today. We've got year six who are leaving today on their way to our high school. But as we all know, it's a 
a sad and happy day. It's a sad day because Mr. Richardson is leaving us today, uh, but a happy day because he's got lots of exciting things planned, and I'm very much sure he's going to pop in from time to time. I think he's due to pop in in September anyway for a little assembly, um, so that's great as well. So can I ask Louise Rowland and Terry O'Neill just to come to the front? <laughs> On behalf of the governing body, um, both past and present, I would just like to say a very big thank you for everything you've done for us here at Hillside, um, the children, parents, the community, um, and all the support that you've particularly given me as the chair of the room in the last few years as well. Uh, and in recognition of your time here, we would like to present you with um, a plaque or two. Um, and this is an acknowledgement of the running track that you've created around school. And the outdoor gym. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. So we just want to say massive thanks to everything that you've done for everybody here in the school. And um, wish you very well for your future. Thank you. Thank you. So those flags are going to be put up on the grounds wow. so that when people can see the fantastic sports that are going on in the school and they see our fantastic running track and our gym then they'll see whose idea it was okay thank and you it's great isn't it right um again we haven't finished with the game okay. um, we're very sporty in this school we're also very musical so i'm going to play a little video now um, from some of our fantastic musicians um, I'd like to thank Jackie Keating, who's sat at the back, who is one of our fantastic music teachers, um, who's uh, helped put this little um, song together. And I'm wondering if you can recognise the tune, okay?
So we will we will miss you. It's the first tune, and please join the fellow. So good musicians. <laughs> Next, really important, um, I would like to ask Mrs. B to come to the front. Ah, just before Mrs. B, can I also ask Uma to come to the front? Uma. Right, part of our school community is Link Club, and I believe on behalf of Link Club, Uma has got something to present to Mr. Richardson, is that right? What is it? I think it's a piñata. I don't know the relevance of it, but it's a piñata, so go on, take it out. <laughs> Okay, so it's all right in your garden. Yeah. Okay, next, um, on behalf of the staff and governors and parents, it's been a joint um, collection. Um, so thank you to all your parents who have contributed. Um, but the reason we've done it is because we really care about Mr. Richardson, we're really going to miss him. Um, and so I think Mrs. B is going to present something. Okay, so Mrs. B, Some of the first one just is from Lois. Thank you, Lois. Uh, what room do skeletons not go in? The living room. Oh. <laughs> Better than Mr. Richardson's. Uh, Emma Hanlon, uh, a man fell off his bike and broke all of his left side. He's all right now, though. <laughs> Oh, wow. Brilliant. Um, so there's £170 worth of um, vouchers for your local golf club. Brilliant. Thank you. <laughs> Which means I might be able to get some practice in. I've actually started playing a bit more golf again now because my son's a member at Vickers Cross. And um, when I used to take him, I could beat him, and now he's getting too good, so that'll help me try and get. Because some of you will know I am quite competitive, so I can't let him win, so I'll have to, I'll, that'll help me get a little bit better. Thank you. Perfect. And they're universal, so they can either be spent on lessons or in the shop. Perfect. Thank you. 
Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a, a voucher for Dino for some wine tasting and a meal. For you and Catherine. Well, if you choose to take Catherine. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's brilliant. Wow. The, the, the small event. And in my garden at home, I have got a plum tree and I've got an apple tree, very fortunately. Um, now I've got a pear tree to go with them. So that's perfect. Thank you. I'll, I'll read all the jokes later. Sam, what's a Ferrari's favourite food? Fast food. Book. Ah, the bump of your silly jokes, brilliant. Because my I've gone through all my joke book. I bet I think I've used every single one. So as you can probably tell, I was running out. So brilliant. A book of silly jokes. What do cats eat for breakfast? Mice Krispies. <laughs> Brilliant, thank you. And then this one. Most unusual Pull it present up. I've ever seen. Pull it up. Oh, wow. Uh, nice and light as well. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, Erica, you mentioned in year four. What is it, Erica? Make this book for you. We hope you like it. Oh, thank you very much. That's the book from year four. Thanks, Erica. From a few years ago, isn't it? That's when we was our centenary, I think. Yeah, I shall look at that in a minute. Um, I'm not sure if Mr. Khan is going to say a few words. I think Louise, she's all, you've already said a few so words. I just, say a few yes, words. I just, yes. just want to say thank you to everybody for your fantastic gifts and really kind gifts. I just want to say um, thank you to everybody that's children, especially the staff, um, governors parents and the whole school community really for your support over the last 12 years. It's been an absolute honour and a pleasure to be head teacher of this fantastic school. Um, you know, uh, in the words of Brian Clough, I wouldn't say um, it's the best school in the world, but it's in the top one. <laughs> so uh, it really has been a pleasure and it's been brilliant to see what must be hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of children who've passed through school over the years, um, including the 212 who are with us now. So thank you to all of you for trying so hard. Keep trying your best. And if you try hard and do your best, you're going to achieve great things. Um, and I hope uh, that the Craig Richardson running track and the Craig Richardson outdoor gym, um, maybe in, I don't know, 15 years, 20 years time, uh, I'm reading about somebody who started off running around the running track and is then running in the in the Olympics or something like that. That'd be fantastic, wouldn't it? So I hope it inspires you to keep active uh, and, and to go on and uh, succeed. So thanks very much, everybody. Um, it's been a pleasure and uh, good luck for the future. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, we just wanted to say, uh, on behalf of Hillside um, children and teachers, thank you so much. Um, you've got your pound of flesh out of us, teachers, but along the way, just like the school motto of learn, laugh and play, there's been so much learning in every way Absolutely. for the children. There's been a, so much laughter 
I think the jokes sum, sum, the, sum up the atmosphere in school. Um, but there's also been a lot of laughter amongst the staff as well. Um, and obviously there's been a lot of lovely playing with the children as well. Um, and I just want to say it's been a pleasure um, working with you for the last 12 years. Uh, some of us were here when you already when you started. Um, and some, lots of staff have joined you along the way. But to say it's been a blast and it's been a pleasure. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, it's been really supportive of the creative side of Hillside. I'm sure Jackie would agree that we've done lots of lovely music and creative activities. And we think Mr. Richardson's been a great sport. Um, you might get to see the pictures in a minute if we stick it in. Um, he's dressed as a dog, a tree, a lion, all sorts of things. He's been traction man. He was Pencil, in a crayon, crayon. I don't know if y'all remember, guys, but he's been a really good sport and he's been up for anything we've asked him. And I think I've asked a lot. Yes, the last thing we'd like to share with you um, is that Mrs. Fletcher Curran has uh, organised this. We've done a little musical um, number that hopefully should involve um, the whole school. So we hope you enjoy this.
I think that brings us to the end of our celebration and farewell assembly. And I'd like to thank all the children for sitting so sensibly. I'd like to thank the parents for joining us. I'd like to say well done to all the winners. I'd like to thank our governors for joining us and saying goodbye to Mr. Richardson. I'd like to thank Reverend Green, who also is um, retiring. So, um, but I'm, re I'm sure we're going to get Reverend Green in again before you actually leave. So uh, we'll be getting Reverend Green in again so we can give him a proper um, goodbye. So I'm going to hand over, possibly for the last time, to Mr. Richardson to say goodbye to everyone and then to send the classes out with a backdrop of some photos. <laughs> Um, so if I can just say thanks, everybody. Um, all the best to Graham as well, yeah, uh, with your uh, retirement. I know you're going to come in in September, I think, to see everybody. I'm going to pop back in September because I've gift, got a gift for you as well. I thought, um, I was trying to think of something that I could leave that, that, would, uh, that you would enjoy and that would, would, um, would help you going forward. So I've got a, uh, a friendship bench, uh, which has just got on it, actually, seen all Craig Richardson's everywhere. Now there's plaques, I didn't know about the plaques. <laughs> it just says, um, Hillside's friendship bench, um, Mr. Richardson, head teacher, and learn, laugh, and play. And it's a bench, I thought, that friends could sit on. And then, like we've talked about in some of our assemblies, maybe if you've not got a friend or you're a bit lonely that day, you could sit on the friendship bench, and somebody sees you on the bench, then somebody will come and talk to you and help you and be kind to you. So hopefully that's been delivered over the holidays. I thought it would have been maybe been here today, but it's gonna be over the holidays. So Mr. Carnes very kindly said I can come back in September to kind of unveil that and give that to you in September. So um, hopefully uh, I'll see you in September. Um, so I'm gonna put the picture on and say for the last time, thanks, uh, thanks everybody and bye bye Hillside. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks everyone.